Hello, I'm Bleep. This is the Bleepcast. I hope the day finds you well. Uh, new indie game, Alba, a wildlife adventure dropped yesterday, and I just kind of glanced at it, and it gave me some uh, Pokemon Snap vibes, which I'm a big fan of. Uh, so I want to check it out. Seems like you're a child taking pictures of real wildlife in your surrounding area where you live. Uh, I don't know much about it beyond that, so let's jump in. Uh, right away, this graphic style is real cute. <laughs> I will say that I'm ignorant to uh, animals, so to me that's just bird. <laughs> I couldn't tell you what kind of bird it is. Beyond cute, you know, cute bird. Waz to move Alba? Oh boy, look at that little toddler walk. E to talk. Where is my baby Alba? Here you are, Mia Moore. Always chasing birds. Speaking of bird lovers, Granddad finally returns. Look, he's behind you. Oh no. Hmm. Mouse a little slow. I might have to up that. Sorry, got distracted back there. I thought I'd seen a glossy ibis in the nature reserve. I'm going to guess that's another type of bird. Turned out to be a mere moorhen. Oh, what's that there? My two favorite humans. Whoosh. That one is for the Alba. Alas, the bane of the photographer is to never appear in pictures. Alba, Bonica, why don't you take a picture of me and Abuela? Come over here, you can use my phone. Uh, I will apologize in advance for any words that I mispronounce. Oh boy, we're gonna take our first picture. Here you go, Alba, please. Don't drop it. It's just your phone. <laughs> You're acting pretty high and mighty with your photography there. Just point the phone and click the button. Try to get me and Abuelita in the picture. Bump, 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 bump. Take a photo of Granddad and Grandma. Uh, it doesn't tell me how to do that. Okay, so two... We're going to zoom in. Going to center everything. Wham. Uh, that is not the picture I took. <laughs> Making me look uh, worse than I did here. Okay. Look in the photo. An Iberian lynx. Here in the nature reserve. The king of the forest. What a magnificent creature. Alba's first photo. Granddad, king of the forest, and grandma. Here's to many more summers together. Love, abuelo, and abuela. Ooh, 10 years later. Monday morning. Flight 319 LGW, VLC. I don't know. Call signs for airports. <laughs> Uh, yeah, this is my Ustwo Games. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but they made Monument Valley, which is one of the most famous uh, cell phone games ever made. I never sat through the whole thing, though. Bienvenida, Alba. So happy you're back for the week. Yes, we are. And don't forget, the town festival is on Saturday. Are you excited? Uh, yes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I knew you would be. And don't worry, this time we won't ask you to dance with us. At least not in front of the whole town. You must be hungry after your travels. Let's go to La Cueta for lunch to celebrate your arrival. Last call for boat to La Quaqueta. Children go free.
We're a little early. The pa paella won't be ready. Paella. Wow, I messed that up. Why don't you go check out the island while Granddad and I chill? Wait, that reminds me. I have a gift for you. A wildlife guide. <sighs> Fauna of the Mediterranean. The guide lists all the wildlife you can find around here. Remember the Iberian lynx? From 10 years ago? <laughs> That's such a funny mechanism. I knew you'd remember. I wish we could go and look for one together this week. But sadly, they are practically extinct these days. Your abuelo is right. No chance finding one now. But maybe you'll spot some dolphins. Now go explore. We'll text you when lunch is ready. Oh boy. I don't have anything to take pictures with yet, but I want to snap this Boyd. I can at least chase it off. Oh boy. That is one cute sneaking animation. <laughs> uh, this game is very cute. I'm hoping it'll be very relaxing. Is that a sandpiper? Is that a bird I know? It's a word I know. <laughs> Alba! Yas! Dude, you're back! It's me! Ennis! Your bestest friend! Did you miss me? Of course you did. It's been like a year. I count it. Come on, let me show you around. It is entirely possible that I said 10 years have passed, but I think it's more likely it was 10 months. Which is a big difference, because this kid doesn't like they grew up that much. Hmm. Follow Ennis to the paella in the restaurant. I want to talk to this old timer. Last spoke back to Sakara, and at su is at sunset. Hmm. Plenty of time. Enjoy exploring La Roquette. What's Granddad got to say? Why don't you go explore the island while we wait for lunch? Lunch will be a while. Go have some fun while we wait. But I thought I'm following this person to the food. Look who's back, Cousin Pepe. Alba, you've grown so much since last year. We're going to go explore the island. Back later. All right. Follow Ennis to the ancient ruins. Ooh. What kind of tunes we got here. Viejos como los más pequeños. Cuidado, tanto sol significa que hay riesgo de quemarse, mm -hmm. así mm -hmm. que vayan. Ooh, there we go. Jamming. Natalia. One more level and I'll get on the on with painting the wall. No. Okay. That one didn't count. I wonder if they're playing Monument Valley. Miguel. Hey, kid. Your pay ain't ready yet. Had to do three large for Pepe. But shouldn't be much longer. Why don't you play with your friend in the meantime? And don't you worry. Won't let Pepe near this one. Uh, don't scratch your back with the spoon, please. What can I do with this laundry? Oh, I can help. <laughs> I did the laundry. Bagel me fangies, how's it going? That darn Pepe's always eating all the paella. It's a problem I've had constantly in life. I can pick up garbage. Who would litter like that anyway? I don't know about anyone else, but ever since I was a little kid, I've always cut those soda six-pack rings. I feel like it would be a shame not to. I don't know how much good I've done. Uh, I probably shouldn't have been drinking the soda with the little six-pack rings to begin with. But uh, I wouldn't want some animal getting caught in it on my behalf. Uh, I am well, Bagel Me Fingies. Thanks for asking. I'm just exploring an island with Alba. You can sneak like this. <laughs> oh, there's more garbage. 
but I can't pick it up. Hmm. It is pretty adorable. This whole game is so far. There's more garbage. I want to pick up all the garbage. There's a squirrel. We are at... Oh, it's just the same place we already were. This place is real nasty. These ancient ruins are like very broken. Fourth favorite ruins. Wait, what's that noise? I'm pretty sure it's dolphins myself. Oh no. I don't like that at all. Oh no, look. There's a stranded dolphin. Come on down to the peach. That dolphin needs our help. Run faster, kid. We gotta save that dolphin. Hmm. Maybe we get to pick up this garbage later. <laughs> we freaked that bird out. We're gonna interact. The dolphin's trapped in a net. We gotta rescue it. Quickly. It's too heavy. We need more people. I'm gonna deal with this net. You get more help. Hmm, I suppose we should run back to where we started. Maybe Pepe can stop eating all the papaya and help this dolphin. A dolphin? On my way. The papaya can wait. I'm glad you've got your priorities straight, Pepe. Oh, look at that kitty. A stranded dolphin? Let's go. Round up everyone to chip in. Dolphins weigh a ton. Yeah, we're halfway there. Come on, old man. We're going to rescue a dolphin. A dolphin washed ashore? Of course I'll help. Get off your phone. There's a, a dolphin that needs help. A dolphin rescue operation? I'm live streaming that. Hey, me too. I feel you. A dolphin? Stranded? Say no more. I'll see you there. We did it. Return the dolphin to the sea. Alba, there's like a million people here. Let's move this dolphin. Where all systems go, Alba. Everyone is here, Alba. Let's do this. Alright, let's get to moving. <laughs> Viva! You and Ennis saved the dolphin's life. Look, the dolphin is saying thanks. The perfect photo opportunity. Oh, Granddad's got a real photo this uh, camera this time. I don't know, Dejen. Uh, <laughs> how much do you think a dolphin weighs? HC, how's it going? You tell Ray I said hi. Well, if she's watching. Hi, Ray. Alba. Alba. Bam. I've seen the light. Our purpose in life. This is going to hit you hard, man. Ready for it? Alba and Ennis. Wildlife Rescue League. The AIWRL. Okay. Name needs a brainstorm, but the goal remains. The wildlife is now under our protection. We got this. <laughs> It must be a very slow uh, news day around here. So I'll tell you right now, DGen, that I am a weak human being who can maybe lift around 80 pounds. So it would take quite a few me to lift that dolphin and throw it back in the ocean. Girl starts a wildlife league. Come on, wildlife rescuers. Let's head home. I'm glad the sun follows our boat all the way across the ocean. Alba, a wildlife adventure. I would say so far this game is very cute. 
Tuesday is Tuesday. Signs of change. A lot of birds around here. I've heard of a slip and slide, D-Gen. Some might say I've even used one. But I've never used one in conjunction with a dolphin rescue operation. Morning, Alba. Hope you slept well after all that excitement yesterday. <laughs> a bagel. Uh, I'm not miffed about the number of birds. I just feel like we're going to be taking a lot of pictures of birds. Ah, uh, morning, Alba. Sorry. Ah, uh, yes. We have to keep it down. Your abuelo is trying to snap birds. See? Look at that. Right off the bat, we're snapping birds. He hasn't had much luck this morning. Hmm. Why aren't there any birds? Aha! There's no bird food. That's why. <gasps> Such a sad bird feeder. Alba, do you mind filling up the bird feeder for me, please? <gasps> Alpiste. I need to be ready to take photos at a moment's notice. I mean, I'm pretty short. I don't see how I'm re realistically filling that with anything. I'm not really psych uh, psychic baggle. I just play one on the internet. Do your abuelo a solid. The bird feeder's just on that tree. It's full. Now we got three birds. Estupendo. We've got birds. Let's check them out, Alba. Here. I have my old phone. It has the Wildlife Guide companion app. Yes, every kid gets a phone. Now just point, click, and identify. Try it with the birds on the feeder. Unidentified birdies. I want to go for the triple. Oh, you can't. We'll go with that. Ooh, that's pretty good, actually. Because that other bird is peeking around the corner. Let's identify. A house sparrow. Passer domesticus. Alright, we got one pitcher and one bird. Did you find out what bird it is? Hold on, it's my best it's the best part of the game. Oh shoot. I accidentally grabbed the whole window. <laughs> That's cheating. I saw you using an app. It's a great app, and it works on all animals, not just birds. But mostly birds. You can go and explore now. Have fun scanning animals. Alright. Now the real fun begins, because I'm going to be snapping pictures like, whoa. Does granddad count as an animal? Doesn't seem like it. <laughs> hmm. All those animals before, now I ain't seeing nothing. Ooh. Too small. Oh, come on. I think you're going to enjoy scanning and identifying animals. Some are super rare these days. That's probably a sad thing, right? I mean, this is real life. You know, it's not like we get sad in Pokemon whenever uh, you're like, oh, this is a super rare Pokemon, because that's just, that's just the way it is. We don't think about the fact that it means, oh, that Pokemon's probably on the endangered species list. But in this game, if there is a rare animal, it's probably because it's dying out. And that's, uh, that's no good. I'm gonna snap that- oops! You can't walk around with your camera out. And that's sad news. Alright, stand back up. Oh no! Waddle waddle. I'm gonna take a picture of this bird butt. 
Will you stop waddling out of my viewfinder? Oh, we already know the house sparrow, obviously. Ah, fudge. Going for it. <laughs> that is a collared dove. Streptopelia decaucocto. Sorry, I'm rusty on my Latin. I wonder if they taste good with collard greens. Alba, I almost forgot. Take this map so you don't get lost. Have fun. <gasps> map. I'm the map. Well, we've got two animals. I wonder if there's any more around this way. I see a sparrow in the distance. I recognize that bird because of bad tattoos. What's this sad little, uh... Can I fix that? Nope. That's one sad birdhouse, though. Oh, this is someone else's house. I can't just, uh... trounce all over it willy-nilly. Ooh, that bird's got a beat I can dance to. these are the same people of Sakara. come to the nature reserve I have a fantastic announcement find the mayor at the nature reserve oh here I was thinking this is the same bird we already saw we found a great tit I've been looking for one my whole life Paris Major Oh, shoot. Squirrel. And that is... A red squirrel. Cyrus vulgaris. The squirrels are freaking terrible. I'm sorry to say. <laughs> Apologies to any squirrel fans. But I've had enough problems with them in my life that uh, you'll find little love for them at this house. Oh. Hmm. Sorry. I can only make so many great tit jokes that I'll uh, I'll just refrain. Another clean area. Is that a kitty? We've got... Domestic cat, Bellis Catus. Very nice. Seems like there's only one cat, so there's no reason to take a picture of every single cat we see. More garbage. Hey, vote Tony. I think that is the... Oh, no, that is not. That's a pigeon. A feral pigeon. Columba Livia Domestica. How great. What about this guy? That is just a house sparrow. Another one of the pigeons. Hmm.
Face nope, huh? Who's putting this uh, graffiti around town? Like, I don't think we need a picture of that cat, too, do we? Yep, just a regular old kitty. LOA gave me all these oranges, and I only asked for a few to make one cake. But the more the merrier, I say. Can never have too many cakes. Don't worry, dear. I'll give the oranges a really good wash. Well, I appreciate you cleaning them, and I agree about the cake. What's this up here? Oh, it tells us what wildlife is in the area. We have a feral pigeon, a domestic cat, a red squirrel, a great tit, a collared dove, and a house sparrow. We have to move them to the sign. Okay. So we're going to select that and put it there. We're going to select that and put it there. And we are missing a crested tit and a Eurasian arrowhawk. I'm guessing that's what that says. Well, that's fun. Well, there's something we haven't seen yet. Get in there. Oh, no. Come back, birdie. Hmm. There's the collared dove. Too many collared doves, if you ask me. Oh, it's back. And looking better than ever. Look at that. How cute. That's the blue tit. Cyanistes Chirulius. Once again, I apologize about my pronunciation. Hope these warnings about uh, wildfires isn't foreshadowing. I'll be really upset. This becomes a fire watch scenario. Uh, Firewatch is a fantastic game, though, if anyone hasn't played it. Uh, it. I still think about it from time to time. Ooh. Hakuna. Matata. What do we got here? That is... Oh, it's a crested tit. No, it's a coal tit. Paraparis Aether. What is this? Full tip. Okay. Hmm. Why well, have a sign with four animals on it living in the area if so many other animals live in the area also? Full tit. Bird scared me. Such a relaxing place. Maybe I can't take pictures from here. Can't take a picture of that, though. Stupid seagull. Doesn't even know we're watching him. Lesser black back gull. Laris Fuscus. I bet you that's too far away. Oblique, how you doing? I'm just snapping pictures of Boyd's. And a squirrel and a cat here and there. But mostly birds. A lot of low-hanging tit jokes here that we're leaving out. So I want you to be proud of me. It does sound like the life. Watch this sneaking animation. Which I think is pretty great. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourself and I hope you have a great day. See you next time on the Bleepcast.